What's going on guys, Rob A here, and we're just going to do a quick video, uh, just real, real simple, on installing uh, Sever's little modesty panels here that came with uh, Fans Toys Stomp. So, we just got these little panels, one for each side of course, and they just require a little bit of installation. They actually do include their own screwdriver, so that's pretty cool. So we're just going to go ahead and get that started. I, I thought it might be a little easier to do this while he's in robot mode, uh, so we'll kind of see how that goes. So, first of all, for those of you uh, that are not aware, he does have this whole section here, and actually maybe we'll start transforming him a little bit as I talk. So, <clears throat> he's got this section at where uh, all of this area has a gap so that his head in, in dinosaur mode head and everything can kind of fit in there and swing around to kind of form the bulk of his inner leg. Um, <clears throat> but when he's in dinosaur mode, it kind of leaves this unsightly hole in his, I guess, chest area, uh, in his stegosaur chest. So a lot of people were not terribly happy with that. So Fans Toys decided that with their uh, most current release, which is uh, Stomp, they would actually release uh, new parts to kind of fix that problem. So here's basically the piece that we're going to be uh, replacing. And uh, we're going to go ahead and get that Dern now. <laughs> all right. So we've got all these bits here. And we've got our screwdriver. So basically what we want to do is we're going to go ahead and uh, remove, oops, we're going to remove the screws. So there's one, two, three screws here. That's fine. That's fine, Sever. You just rest. You relax. Okay. I'm having a little bit of a hard time with this just due to uh, apparently Butterfingers really more than anything else. So I'm just going to take this whole piece off, just so it's a little bit easier to uh, to work with, figure figure out what I'm doing here. Basically, just want to loosen all those screws, and it should come loose without any trouble. But uh, it's it's wanting to be a little troublesome, which I'm not quite sure what the problem is here. Oh, there we go. <laughs> the minute I said it. All right, so we've got this piece off here. Now we just want to grab the replacement piece. Make sure it's all like in the proper area. Just kind of seat it in there. And then just screw everything back together. I don't know why I'm still using this <laughs> little screwdriver. It's not very good. Ugh. This one might be a little better for me. There we go. Alright, so we've got that piece all settled up. Let's attach it back to the body. Go. So 
switch to a little bit larger screwdriver here just to get that larger screw sorted. There we go. And do the same with the dyno head. So you can see you now have this little flap here that will uh, cover his chest up in dinosaur mode. Now be aware that when you do have him in robot mode it does not close all the way. So I'll show you that real quick here. Let's close this up. Just a little legs all together here. Close that up. So he does have the panel here now and you can close it up, but it's going to be, there's going to be a slight, slight gap here at the back of his leg. And it's really not a big deal, uh, but it is there. So just, just be aware of that. This will not sit flush when he's in robot mode because of this flap. Um, but it's really not that big of a deal. It is on the back of his leg. Um, he's doing a little... A little sweet jazz <laughs> jazz dance going on here um, <clears throat> but yeah so that's really it so you just do that on the other side and then you've got yourself a complete and sweet new sever leg I almost said severed leg I don't know. <laughs> it's so, weird. Um, so yeah I'm just gonna go ahead and install the other one and then we'll meet back here to check out the results all right, guys, and to just quickly show you, we've got the new parts installed, and we can flip, sever over, and there you go. All set. And honestly, like, looking at these these pieces, it, it really honestly almost looks as though there was always intended to be a piece there, but maybe, like, they went over budget, or I don't know, they did something where, you know, it just wasn't going to work for them. But it's actually really fine, and everything... Worked out beautifully. Uh, you should have a nice, solid stegosaur now. He's just a little, little, little hole here. It's an air intake because you know he's super fast. Uh, but Sever no longer shops at Gap, um, so very, very cool. My big thanks to Fans Toys for adding that in. I know they really didn't have to, but uh, it was nice of them too. So. That is going to do it for this one, guys. Um, if you enjoyed the video and found it useful, helpful, whatever, uh, hit that like button. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more. Um, I'll be back with more stuff soon, so uh, stick around for that. In the meantime, thanks again for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.